Welcome back to Destination Playdate. I am your host, Attack Slug, and this is Jolly Chimp Champ out now on catalog. It is $6. It is a crank based puzzle game, stage based, with 100 stages, and you are controlling with the crank the conveyor belt in each of these stages, trying to get your creepy symbol monkey to the goal. So, very simply, you crank either back or fourth, and in this case there is a cannon shooting cannonballs, and you don't want that. So we're gonna crank real fast to not get hit by the cannonballs on stage 16 of 100. There is no stage select, really. It's options is, hey, you can skip a level, but there's no, hey, go back to a pre previous level type bit of business. So we're gonna keep on doing this here, and it does escalate the game mechanics as such. I didn't want to get too far and not show off important things. Oh my god. We got it. 18 complete. My only real complaint here thus far is the cymbal sound does eventually get very grating and annoying. I understand why it's there. I get it. One of my all-time favorite episodes of MST3K had a creepy cymbal monkey, but it's just annoying, man. And I died. So, try again. Let's just try to blaze it. Nope, I couldn't blaze it. I couldn't go fast enough. I thought maybe... There we go. Just crank it real hard on the play date. And... Alright, look at that. So, I'm gonna block the cannonballs with the box and not get hit by... Okay, yes, you can. Just it's one pixel almost where you can kind of get that to where it needs to be. So you very slowly, gently crank it to where you're blocking it, and then complete stage number 20. But there are more complex mechanics. As you can see, it does require some finesse. So there are parts where you gotta use your brain more than just your reflexes. And those are all of the earlier stages that I've obviously gotten past because that's... Alright, so here's one of the things. This four-way symbol will stop you and turn you. And once you turn in the direction you want to actually be going in, which is backwards, watch. So if I go here, and I turn, and I turn, I can keep turning, right? But you want to be sure that your back is facing the direction, and then you crank the other way. Because otherwise, it ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna fly. And when that becomes a timing-based thing, it does get very tricky to deal with. And so it's, you crank, and if you're gonna go into the abyss, you crank the other way, but make sure the monkey has transferred between the conveyor belts is the main thing here. And I don't like that at all. Requires a bit of finesse, if you will. But other than figuring out exactly where and how you need to move, it's a pretty straightforward bit of business in a video game. So it is a just crank-based, stage-based puzzler. And I don't want to get hit by these cannons so we'll do one more and i think you kind of get the idea here in jolly chimp champ i don't know how i'm gonna not gonna get hit by these things i don't know how i'm not gonna get hit by like there's just what oh that's clever but now what that's no see i just screwed myself there there's nowhere to go! So if I can do that again without totally moving the monkey onto the thing, then maybe I can get through this, because otherwise... And so for the sake of the video, let's see what happens when I say, you know what, 25 is too much for me, let's skip this level, and then... Okay, here we are at 26, and that's just gone forever, I guess. So keep that in mind when you're skipping levels here in Jolly Chimp Champ.
but I would imagine, at only being 26 of 100, there are more mechanics to uncover as you play through Into the Hole. Jolly Chimp Champ, out now, on catalog, it is $6. I am your host, a tax lug. Keep on cranking more videos right here on this channel. I'll see you next time, and I'm out.